watch both of these guys. Phil Cardella coming in with an uh, impressive Brazilian jiu-jitsu skills, one of the best grapplers in the nation. Oh, and he goes oh, for a jump in the Holy cow, man. <laughs> Looks like he's been practicing Whoa. Jim Cotta. Absolutely. Yeah, but watch him off his back. He's got great, great Brazilian jiu-jitsu skills, great submission skills. But as we know, Steve Kennison is an excellent fighter himself. Both hey, I'm these a guys Steve Kennison tackle. fan. I, uh, you know, I, and Phil Cardella, as you said, great credentials to come in. But, yeah, but, going uh, right after the both triangle. of these guys have great skills. And, yeah, a quick triangle put on here. I don't know how much trouble Kennison's in, but he is, uh, wow, it looks like he's going for the arm bar now, and that could be yeah, it. Yeah, quick arm bar attempt there by Cardella. And like I said, Cardella with world-class oh, Brazilian jiu-jitsu skills. Wow. Oh, unbelievable. Look at Sankaku now. Looks like a reverse triangle. Sure is. Sure is. Looks like, I don't know if he can finish it. It's, it's really hard to finish somebody from this position. Hey, Cardella went for a standard triangle to a foot lock to a Sankaku no, reverse triangle. No, standard triangle to an armbar foot lock, then a Sankaku triangle. Unbelievable. Four, four submission attempts in like 30 seconds. That's Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu skills I'm talking about right there. This guy is a freak. He's known throughout the whole United States as having some of the best Jiu-Jitsu skills around. Uh, and it's a real treat to have him here in this show. He's fighting a very tough Steve Kennison. Steve Kennison is going to be, I'm telling you, he'll be very smart to stand up in this fight because uh, I don't know if he can, uh, he can withstand the whole onslaught of submission attack.